I'm not against uh, this uh, concept uh, of polygamy. What? <laughs> About uh, polygamy in Tunisia. Uh, I'm not against uh, the polygamy in Tunisia and I prefer to have as a woman three other men with me. At least. At least. Like four. Like, like if you want for women, I want for men. And they have to be uh, rich, rich enough <laughs> to raise me. Rich, 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 rich. <laughs> and uh, they have to get me Louis Vuitton, <laughs> Chanel, Dior, yeah, you know. So what do you think about polygamy? Well, I'm, uh, I'm monogamous, so I'm against polygamy. Uh, but um, I think uh, a cool idea if uh, anyone who's for polygamy and who's uh, trying to have four, four, four wives, I think it would be cool if he would not be against having um, he would not be against that his woman would have four men. I mean, polygamy should be for everyone if you want to have it. So, uh, so if you want to have uh, four uh, women, or you want to have four men, if they're all okay, okay with it, no one should be consent from everyone. And uh, <laughs> I'm against polygamy because I think that it's a form of discrimination and of oppression. So it could not be applied. So Khadri, what do you think about polygamy in Tunisia? So uh, polygamy is a subject that is really important nowadays in our lives. And I think that it shouldn't be allowed in any country of the world, you know. You know, having four or more uh, women for one man is too much. It's too much treasure for the man, and it's too much, too much uh, of uh, how can I say it? Marriage. Thank you. Uh, hello. Yeah? Uh, what do you think about uh, polygamy in Tunisia and the fact that uh, even today we are considering this uh, issue and uh, uh, always having a talk about it? Yeah, if, if there is a debate about polygamy, it's because there is uh, there are some social sections of our society who are still thinking about it. Uh, they are not accepting uh, what happened by the end of the 1950s uh, decision by the Tunisian state to uh, end this very old tradition, which is uh, rooted in our Islamic sources. And uh, many people who have very strong religious beliefs, they they still. Uh, they still are, are not really convinced that uh, this should stop. So uh, it's uh, it's driven by religious beliefs, but it's also driven by male uh, by the belief in male dominance, and uh, this this goes beyond any religion, and it's uh, it's uh, it's present in all male-dominated societies like ours. So we should we should not be surprised that it's still part of our debate.